All right, we have made it to Wednesday, hump day for all of us here. Let's uh, <laughs> check in with Aaron Moran now, see what the rest of the, uh, the work week is looking like. We're almost to the weekend, almost. I, you know, I really did have to ask myself this morning, what day is it? <laughs> For some reason, I thought it was Thursday. Maybe it was just because we've had a couple of days with sunshine and we've been dealing with this warming trend. It was a beautiful start to this Wednesday. Yes, it is Wednesday. Fort Worth time lapse. We've had the sunny skies all day, a few high thin clouds this afternoon, but no real issues there. Temperatures are still warming up very nicely this afternoon. We've got some spots east of I-35. You can see from Bonham to Terrell, Corsicana, and farther east, you're ranging from 57 to 59 degrees. But then everyone else sitting in the low to mid-60s, 62 in McKinney and Fort Worth. We're at 63 for Dallas and Denton, even up to 65 degrees in Breckenridge. This is a huge warm-up compared to this time yesterday, especially for places like Hamilton and Comanche. Remember, they had some of those clouds yesterday. Yesterday afternoon, so they were sitting in the 40s, whereas everyone else was in the 50s. So that's a 19 to 20 degree warm up, Stephenville. Also noticing that. A lot of it has to do not just with the sunshine, but with the wind. That breeze is out of the south southwest, anywhere from 10 to even 15 miles an hour, gusting a little higher than that at times. So you've probably noticed it's getting a little breezier today. Uh, just get ready for tomorrow. So we've got a dry cold front that's going to be moving through. If you kind of want to keep an eye on when this cold front actually passes, you're not going to notice it with any rain. You're not going to notice it with much cloud cover, but you will notice it with that wind change, the directional change, and the speed as well. Once this front moves through, and it moves through pretty quickly, I think most of us are kind of dealing with those north northwest winds by 11, 12 o'clock tomorrow afternoon, but look at the wind speeds. Now, I will say this these are wind gusts, not necessarily the sustained. Winds, but we're talking about upper 30s and low 40 mile an hour wind gusts possible, especially the farther north and west you are. Tomorrow afternoon, we're still dealing with 30 to 35 mile an hour wind gusts. This is out of the north northwest. I think we still warm up tomorrow. It's still going to be a pretty nice day with sunny skies and temperatures in the low 60s. The wind finally begins to die down once we get a little bit closer to sunset, and then we are expecting a cool down. So you do have to be prepared, not necessarily for tomorrow. It still looks like we're getting into the low 60s tomorrow afternoon. We've got plenty of sunshine. It's going to be a really nice day, but those temperatures take a tumble into Friday. We go from a high of 62 on Thursday to a high of 53 on Friday, 56 for Saturday, 59 on Sunday. So a little bit of another warm up into Monday. And then we've got another cold front that moves through for next Tuesday, and that's going to bring our next rain chances. On Sunday, we've got a 10% chance for really an isolated sprinkle more than anything else. Tuesday, though, 30% chance for a few showers. And then into Wednesday, it's going to get cooler, and we've got the rain chances up to 40%. So tonight, we don't have to worry about much. We'll have mostly clear skies, breeze kind of picking up, but still out of the south, upper 30s and low 40s. So that's what you get with a southerly wind. We're not going to be sitting right around freezing tomorrow morning. Tomorrow afternoon, of course, we've got that dry cold front moving through. It's going to be mostly sunny. It's going to be mild. Temperatures get into the low 60s, but it is going to be windy, and it stays windy into Friday as well. We've got temperatures at about 53 on Friday, 56 for Saturday, upper 50s on Sunday, mid 60s for Monday, and then the rain comes next week. Slightly cooler temperatures as well. We'll talk more about that coming up in the next half hour. Ken? Okay, we'll see you in 30 minutes.